Now, what was the tree joke? Because I did enjoy your story. It's just I was really concentrating at that one moment against the boss. <laughs> oh, well, because I was talking about how the tree, like, you know, went into the house. And I was yeah. like, damn, that's a tree house. <laughs> I thought it was funny. You it's were very laughing funny. And I was like, damn. No, it was pretty funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It was pretty funny. All right, system. Uh, window color. Just make it red. I forgot. In my save file, it's purple. That's why. We're purple now. Um, <laughs> shit. Do I have to? Re yes. I think I would have to reset to do the save thing. Ah, well, let's just wing it. <laughs> So, welcome back, guys. I'm actually going to be playing for Brandon this time. Dude, you don't even know so, where you're going. So, let's get a move on. You know, shit, yo. Patrick. Shit, yo. It's been a while since that we've recorded together, but I feel like I've beaten more video games than ever. Like, in my entire life. In the in the past, like, five weeks. Probably. I've beaten maybe 30 video games. And I'm not talking, like, shitty Steam release oh, free you mean, video you games. Oh, you mean talking about, like, in a time span, right? Like in the five weeks you beat that many. I've beat that many in that many weeks. Wow. And I'm not. I'm talking start to finish. Like there was Trauma Center. I, sure, a lot of the Telltale games are kind of story heavy, and it's like, it's only like six hours per episode. Mm -hmm. But like I'm playing through all five. Right. So it's like, all right. So that's a lot of hours. So I've been like six Telltale games. Tales from the Borderlands was fantastic. Game of Thrones was pretty interesting. I might watch the yeah. show. But Walking Dead was. You know, I haven't played obviously. that yet. The yeah. first one was good. I played only a little bit of the second season. <gasps> Plug in right here. If you want to see my Walking Dead Let's Play. That oh. hyperlink that's totally there. Don't watch it. It's terrible. Dude, you're just standing still. Gosh. <laughs> Bro. So, but there's so I many games. No not just like that, but Trauma Center. I've never played it, that game is hard. it's good. That one I haven't beaten, but I'm, I'm on the final boss, which is, which is notorious. What, it's infamous for being difficult. You know what? Basically, Ebola. I hope it's syphilis. Oh my goodness. It is awful. It is hard. So I'm taking a break from that, but let me tell you about a game that almost changed my life. Oh. Life is strange. Life is Holy strange. Holy shit. But before going into it, all I knew about it was that there was cameras, there was SFM props that I could download for Source mm -hmm. from Maker, and that Ashley Birch was voicing a character in it. Mm -hmm. I don't know Ashley Birch, but... Hey, Ash, what you playing? Oh! Okay. I love her! She is awesome. She's so good, and she's great in the game. Where am I going? <laughs> uh, you want to go over there? So I suggest you move left and up. Oh, okay. I can do that much. Yeah, you can. <laughs> we won't get set back three episodes by this one. Get Her ready. Her butt derp. We're gonna but go. Like, I'm. I'm not gonna go into any Life is Strange spoilers, by the way, because I find that a dick move. I don't think you should spoil it. Mean, I want to play the game because... Like, unless it's ent exactly titled Life is Strange, I don't feel good about spoiling it. Like, here's a spoiler cast for Star Wars, and then they talk about spoilers for another movie. I was going to say B-movie for an example, but no one gives a shit about that. For, um, like, uh, for Game of Thrones. Like, mm -hmm. this is a Star Wars podcast. By the way, so-and-so killed so-and-so in the latest Game of Thrones. I don't know why I said that. Hate me, Twitter. I hate that shit. Yeah, I'm does. Twitter. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> um, but Life is Strange is such a fantastic game. The gameplay in the way it it works a lot like a Telltale game, mm -hmm. like telling a story in episodic. Form. Yeah, it, it's similar to like Heavy Rain. I know or... you want to play it really bad, and it is. Well, yeah. you told me. I mean, not. I don't know how badly you want to play it, but not oh. that badly. But like, I want to play it. I want to experience it. It's great, and the way they handle the gameplay, besides just like the character interaction is amazing too my only real complaint is sometimes i go all right your character max max i would not do that max i'm not going to do that max i would do this and those options never tend to appear but that's like, kind of true for all these telltale God games damn it, max <laughs> yeah oh, gosh mm, shit God, just kill yourself. take your top off <laughs> <laughs> but um there's so many cases like that in other telltale games that mm. i kind of have to forgive it it's like well, these characters are characters, so you have to get in their mindset and be rational with them and those characters. Tales from the Borderlands actually taught me that, so I started doing this method where I, like, take a break, and I start acting like that character for a couple days and go back to playing it, and I tend to have more fun making those decisions. So I did that with Life is Strange, and let me tell you, I turned into a photogra photographer, 18-year-old girl, <laughs> okay. living by herself in a dorm room, and let me tell you, I picked up some nasty habits. <laughs> Like? Uh, life-changing habits. Oh, God. 
Yeah. Um. I, I see photo opportunities everywhere. Sometimes I want to talk about stupid shit. It's. It, it kind of just blends into my personality, you know? It'll fade away eventually, but it's like, it sticks with me. But let me tell you, the game is so good that I wouldn't do this with any other Telltale type game. By the way, this is made by Squeenix. Um, Squeenix? Yeah. Dude, Square Enix takes way too long to say, especially when you're listing off all the Squeenix titles in Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts 1, Kingdom Hearts 2, Kingdom Hearts 2.7, 2.8, 2.9. HD Remaster Collection Kingdom Heart Hearts. Kingdom Hearts Card <laughs> Masters or whatever. Kingdom Hearts the board game. Squeenix the Kingdom Hearts Tale of Squeenix. Squee! That's my favorite game. Yeah, but one thing I'm doing with Life is Strange yeah, yeah. that I'm not doing with any other is I made it to episode four or five and I went, I need to play this again. I'm starting over. Really? I'm playing episode one all the way up to five again before I play episode five. Because that's the conclusion. Wow. That's the big conclusion. Yeah, so you just like want to remember all your choices and everything like that. Exactly, and I want to try and make some different choices and see if I could change events and see how it goes. Mm -hmm. And it, I wouldn't do this with any other game. So this game is really, it, it's up there for me. It's honestly yeah. fantastic, and I'd recommend it to anyone. It is great. Damn. Yeah, I know. Kieran, Kieran told me about, like, he's not like a huge gamer or anything, but he told me like how, like, he really liked Life is Strange. Yeah, it is. Like, it's just like. It, it's really well crafted. It is that. Oh, it is. And Ashley's character, Chloe, is the greatest thing to ever happen. Ah! By the way, I now have a thing for uh, punk girls with oh, blue hair. Oh, God. That's one of the things that rubbed off on me. <laughs> uh, if, if you look at my... Uh, my uh, God, I love... I just love the smell of failure from those gamer oh, girls. Oh, look, it's, it's Marie, hair. bitch. Mm. No, you don't understand. Listen, I have a deep and personal connection with that video game character. <laughs> so, first it's cosplayers, now it's girl with No, no, it's still cosplayers. Hair. But, like, I've gotten into the habit uh, of... On what level is blue hair versus cosplayers? N now like... I save images that I find on Twitter of, like, punk girl sketches and drawings. And, okay. And it, this is one of my favorite ones. Damn. No, I'm into I'm that. I'm not a fan of the hair, though. I don't like the shape you know, I, side. I, if she's down for it, I'm down for it. You want to shave the sides of your hair? Dude? No, no, not me. I would never. No, yeah, I'm talking about. I really. No, I mean, if she likes it, I'm down for it. I can't really do that. Like, for example, piercings. Oh, d d Ooh. don't Ooh. talk to me. You hate them too? They're give terrible. Me some. Give me some. Listen. Uh, okay, all right. Let terrible. me tell you what's. Gages suck ass. Gages I don't give a terrible. shit what you say. I want a little holes. I can pour soup down your ear. <laughs> I want to put strings on your ear and hang you by your ear. Like Go that's how bad. You, you gotta play that. and talk. Where are you in the map? I don't know. Oh, you're at the stairs. Wait, go left. I gotta go left? Yeah. Alright, cool. Piercers are disgusting. Belly buttons. How do you sleep at night? You, you get up in the morning. You get up in the morning. Ow, clip. Ow, clip. <laughs> ow, clip. Your tongue? What are you doing? Zipper tongues? Oh, my God. Wait, no, no. Oh, <laughs> don't talk. I just meant regular tongue, not zip. No. Oh. Brandon's gonna throw up. Mm. I haven't, I haven't thrown up in 12 years, Patrick. I'm not gonna do it now. I, I haven't thrown up in a months probably dude i was about to throw up in your house yeah you were yeah, you ate a terrible. banana and ran to I the bathroom i ate a banana i was like dude uh, like, hey. these guys oh these a, guys are cool there's a special right, way probably. to defeat them that is yeah. one of them <laughs> okay you could also just like lean a little low <laughs> hey, where'd you go oh like, jesus christ <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> here what you want to do is you want to go up to them but then you want to jump and you want to you can jump that. and slice, jump and slice, jump and slice. And yeah, I could. They can't hit you. Need jump for that. Uh, or, you know, Pat's soul. But yeah, I'm into punk girls right now. Punk I, girls are okay. Like, I don't have a problem with, you know. Yeah, but then that got styles. me thinking into, like, man, that, like, realistically, 90% of them are just gonna look like Kieran, but a girl. <laughs> and I am not into that. <laughs> <laughs> I am it's not. Fun. Well, it's it's kind of true, but you really have 90 percent, just... Patrick, okay. and I I do not play with those odds. You you would have to take Kieran. Let me roll the dice. That is. You'd have to take Kieran. Nope. You'd have to take Kieran and give him RG's haircut and paint his nails. Which off. one? <laughs> Keep his... going. You're about to hit a boss, and by the way. Better ones. You're gonna hit a boss soon. You wanna play? Cause I'm terrible at yeah, this Yeah, sure. But uh, that also got me thinking, how well do I know you, Patrick? Um... No, no, no. Uh, you, you, go on. How well do I know you? I would say you know about 
fifty percent. What is of what does that arbitrary <laughs> number even mean? That means you know me about half as well as I know myself. Oh, okay. Like I'm a hundred percent, obviously. Kira would probably be eighty percent. Yeah. And you would probably be down to half, which is fifty. Forty. 50, obviously. All right, I, it's just you didn't respond, so I was like, does he? <laughs> well, no, because I, I was going to say, you're probably second or third, Shit. like, you probably know me second yeah, or yeah. third best out of anyone, but. Go on. It, I think it's just the fact that, first off, you weren't in high school with me. That's true. I did go to a very special and school. And second off, we only, I think, I think we only became friends, what, seventh grade, eighth grade? Eighth. Eighth, yeah, just about. Actually, right after we started, because right after we became friends, we started doing let's plays together. Exactly. Almost immediately. In my retrospective, I don't think I know you like at all. I am. I think I know you about like if you were hundred percent. I think I know you like thirty-five. Oh man, so little people know me. Well, I think it's because a lot of people put you in the category that you're like a little kid. <laughs> A honest. lot of people do. There's usually three <laughs> categories with people who know me, uh, or like try to get to know me. Mm -hmm. Either A, they worship me. So no one. And no, no, no. no. <laughs> y you don't understand. Like a surprising amount. Like they, they hold me on this pedestal because I'm so uniquely different mm -hmm. from a lot of people. The others treat me like I'm a little babu because you know the the whole like sex and relationship thing. And I'm oh, just yeah. a kid. I don't yeah, care. Exactly. Oh, that and that's mostly true. And then there's the people who actually get to know me, and then that's when they make the decision, okay, so do I leave this kid forever, or am I actually going to still be his friend? Let me tell you, uh, like, uh, 11 out of 12 times, it's usually leave. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm still here for you. Man, if I'm all you... Here. No, we'll find out when you get there. <laughs> is that is that, a, is that really the boss? Yep, that's Puppet Sword. Uh, best part about so this boss so is much. I can skip him. Yep. Good to know. Yeah, I don't give a shit about him. <laughs> Best part is when I re-enter that room. Man, I wish life was like that. Having a tough time, skip it. So I need this night shield because our shield sucks ass. Um because yeah, we have the leather shield. Really does. So I decided to grab it. Um it looks a little cooler too. And I think it's purple. Does it yeah. work the same way as the other one where if yeah. you get hit oh, okay. No, well, I have no idea. Actually, that that was like a fluke. That's I not tested. <laughs> um just in case. But that got me thinking. Patrick, how well do I know you, but even more so, how do I, how well do I know you that I can guess what your dream girl looks like? Mmm. And that is, that is That's what I That's probably gonna be very difficult because even I don't know what my, uh, I've never been in love. No, 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 we're so, not talking about love. We're talking okay, about, well, we're talking is... about what face do you want to see when you crush? And I mean crush hard. Down to the soul. And we're not just talking face. We're talking body shape. Body. And what was okay. that? Oh, wait. Okay, I want you to- Wait, wait, wait. Shh. If you're silent, the ghost of Father Matthews will appear and diddle you. <gasps> <laughs> there he is! Hey, little boy. Oh. Oh, oh shit! Get... Oh, no! Oh, oh no, no Father Matthews! I my was, diddle stick! I was just getting naked! Hold oh, on. no, it's pain! No, don't tell the cops! Right, anyway, um... <laughs> So you, go on. <laughs> I want you to. I want you to say what you think my dream girl is. I, I want to say I'll that too. You. So uh, go for it. Mostly because of the game we played the other night, where we guessed our top most viewed videos on oh, each other's channels, yeah. and which ones included us. Oh gosh, I, I I absolutely hate this part. They suck. These guys suck. They're little assholes. Yeah. But yeah, I do, I do want to guess. I know what my dream girl looks like, because I have a type. Mhm. Mm I, I actually want to hear that. I usually afterwards. follow my type. Um, usually sometimes there's like a little outlier and sometimes there's like a big outlier and by little outlier I mean like small differences and big outlier is like mm -hmm. not my type at all That asshole crow. He's gonna be back up there mm -hmm. Here you climb up and don't die right. Um, but yeah when I imagine your dream girl, I don't imagine someone super petite Not someone small. I'm not talking like Patrick's not into the big you bold know, I will be honest. I don't know why, but recently, like, not fat girls, but like, but like, a little there, just a little bit, like the tiniest bit. Yeah, you like? I kind of like, I, but that's not my dream girl type. But continue. Okay, let me specify. When I mean dream girl, I mean like perfectly fits 
what your type would be and not like that model that you saw last week on the Playboy. You got me? Yeah, I know what you mean. And by Playboy, I mean internet, because let's be honest. How do I get to Nobody the buys side? magazines. Huh? Can I, uh, can I jump that? I think so. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. You're good. That was tight. Continue. Man, I, I imagine, like, a, a girl who's, like, a little roundish, but not, like, round. I mean, like, she's... I guess you would call it thick? I don't know. Like... She, yeah, that would like, be actually the perfect explanation. There. Yeah. Like, she's got some boobs, she's got some butt, she's got some everything. She's not, like, this skinny girl where you can see, like, the tone on her muscles. Mm -hmm. She doesn't have a pack of abs, but she's there and she's kind of, like, a bear and lovable and huggable, but smaller than you. Mm -hmm. Uh, not tall at all. Patrick is not into tall. But he's not into super short. Like, we're not talking 5'2", but, like, a 5'4", like, a couple inches under his forehead would be good. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, kind of thing, like, she's the height where if she went on her, like toes her tippy toes like she'd be level with your mouth her mouth but like only if uh i'm guessing brown hair probably not like a super dark brown but like kind of dark it's definitely not like a light brown because light brown gets like frayed and a little like yellowish sometimes in sunlight it's got that sheen uh i don't know eye color i don't really see as a thing but maybe you do nose Anything but like a hook nose, you know, like that, like evil librarian nose. Yep. Oh gosh, especially. You know, people don't say enough, but noses are important, yo. They, they, they really put the whole face together. Without a nose, you look terrible. With a bad nose, you. <laughs> I look don't know terrible. anyone who doesn't have a nose, but. With a bad nose, you look terrible. Where am I going? You're, you're going there. Oh. I mean, you, actually, you can go up. You can go up. That part's dangerous, and I don't want you to die yet. 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 Yeah, you have to go on the other side. Dude, those God ravens and crows are ravens. pieces of shit. Yeah, the crows really screwed yeah. me over a couple but times. But yeah, I'm, th I'm thinking like a dark brunette, kind of thick. Um, and we're not talking personalities, because then that's really complex. Yeah, that's a little too complex. Uh, Definitely Hispanic. Not like thick Hispanic, though. Like kind of white Hispanic, but not too white. Like, okay. It's not like you go, you're not Hispanic. You look Irish, but it's more like, yeah, I can see that. I will say you are... I can't be too specific. Like, if I had The Sims for, like, the creator, I think I can make her. I could mold her. <laughs> I can mold her. I can create life. Torbjorn! <laughs> oh, God. All right. All right. Oh. So now I'll tell you, you are about 80% wrong. Okay. Actually. Oh, Patrick is, into, Patrick is into thick blondes with freckles. No, I, hate, I actually I don't like freckles too oh, much. Freckles can be Some cute. girls look really good with freckles. Yeah. I Others mean, do not. Listen, everyone looks really good with something. Yeah. I go. So, my dream girl, obviously, you know, if I met any girl, personality first. But if we're just talking about no, looks. No, we're not talking personality. That is too complex. About looks, white. Yes. Blonde. Blue eyes. Eyes are actually a thing with me. I, I love blue eyes i would actually prefer if i had blue eyes mm. as much as i like my hazel eyes because i think hazel is really nice i like my dark I, brown like eyes blue. because then I they like almost look black poop eyes <laughs> no because then they almost look black yeah when you stare at me i just and then it's like pure man he's just got huge ass <laughs> pupils that is scary or Jesus cute i'm not Christ. sure man it's terrifying no don't say that i'll catch on fire um she Cold actually back. would be a kind of like thickish but mostly near the lower area, I would say, like thigh wise. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Especially. So, so are you a boomer butt guy? Oh, but like. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> oh, but. But I'm not talking about like her ass is just like fat and it's no, not it means like, you're nice. into butt. It mean, it's it's got to be like nice, big and round. And when I smack it, it like jiggles and plays Mozart. <laughs> <laughs> like it's got to be like, like that's you know, surprisingly how much I like common that. request to play Mozart. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a Mozart song and it can't come to me. Read a book. <laughs> da, 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 da. Uh, or is oh, I don't want to get into this shit yet. Okay, next time on Castlevania. Next time on Castlevania. Patrick's gonna guess my dream girl. I guess I don't really I don't know. know. I love butts, man. Ain't we? Wait, give, give me another try. What? Don't we all? All right, put that first bit in. Don't leave the second bit in. Other... No, you did it! That's not safe.
See, you could stay there, but when I get there, you'll be run over by its own treads. <laughs>